Time this morning, Roosevelt High School in Dallas closed today as a precaution. Police say that someone shot two students off campus Thursday evening, and then those students returned to campus with bullet wounds looking for help. Don White joins us live from the high school. Don, we know that Dallas ISD says it canceled classes due to what they're calling a credible threat. Well, that's right, Madison, and you can see behind me that the high school is very quiet today because of that. I'm going to step out of the way, and you can see that there are several police vehicles here, and police, they are monitoring the campus today. The district didn't elaborate on the threat, but says it expects to give an update later today. It also didn't explicitly connect that threat to the shooting involving students. Dallas police say someone shot the students about a mile away from the school's campus just before 7 p.m. CBS News Texas spoke with a friend of Roosevelt High School football coach Terrence Lowry. He said Coach Lowry was taking two football players home after school and someone shot the two students while they were inside the car. It was really devastating, you know, that it hits this close at home a lot. So I'm still just trying to, you know, grasp it all and I just hope, you know, that the mental of uh, my friend would be okay and hope that those uh, young men would be okay. The investigation is ongoing this morning and police have not named any suspects. Live in Dallas, Dawn White, CBS News, Texas.